Hi guys, I hope you are doing well. Welcome to my channel. In this clip I want to introduce a package for having a data visualization on a globe. Or for example, we have a, an earth and we want to show some numbers or some uh, tables on this uh, 3D earth. Okay, let's take a look at this package over here. A Unity 3D Glob, uh, which has been released almost five years ago by uh, Dundarabi. Uh, you just need to download the whole zip of this package and after that import the assets folder into your uh, project folder. Or you, if you have already TextMesh Pro, you just need to take, uh, import this folder and this folder. Uh, I will share the link of this package in the description of this video. After that, uh, we should take a look at these folders here, Unity 3D Glob here, and the scenes, and this guy. Okay, look at this. First, we have this. And now, if I play the scene... Excellent. Look at this. It's supposed to be the population of the, P, uh, you know, the countries around the world. Look at this. It is beautiful. So you can add any numbers or any information to this uh, data visualization method. Uh, we have this data visualizer here and uh, this guy is for the material of the, those points and it is the proof of the point itself and in here we have the gradient of the colors whenever you want to show the information and in here we have data loader uh, it tries to read the information from resources folder this population.json okay let's take a look at this json file we have uh, three different uh, categories, year uh, 1990, and this, these are the numbers of 1990, and in 1995 and 2000, okay? You can change any number you want. It's, look at this, it's too big, okay? Uh, you can add any number you want, but it, that uh, template of data actually. But if we take a look at this data loader here, uh, we have just public data visualizer, uh, this guy, a data visualizer. We will call this uh, visualizer in the disk. Uh, oh, let me close this guy, yeah, uh, in this part. And in the void start, we will say, okay, let's uh, read the population.json file here and try to create mesh by calling this function by visualizer script itself and in here we will set the areas uh, arrays of the this information uh, we can call this function anytime we want so i just wanted to um, assure that uh, it's gonna be uh, available at any script at any time we want in here, it's just in void the start. You can call this function at any time you want. Okay, this is short. I hope this video will be helpful for you. Don't hesitate to ask any question related to Unity, AR, VR, and XR. Subscribe my channel and like this video if you like it. Have a great time. Bye bye.